So it's been a while since I've uploaded MW2 and uh, for some odd reason I really want to play this rage inducing game while I've already had kind of a shitty day. So uh, do you guys ever get that feeling when uh, you wake up to a certain text or you go into like the next day? So say for example, well today is Friday. Now imagine that you get like a text the night before that you know the following day is just going to be shit. Well you see Thursday and Friday are supposed to be my days off from work and um, no, not today. I got called in. It's like, it wasn't even that bad but I just knew something was going to fucking happen. Just knowing my luck, I literally psyched myself out going into this shit. And for one in itself the shift wasn't even that long nor even that bad to begin with but still. But just anyways as I woke up this morning knowing that I was gonna have to go into work and whatnot I just had a feeling that something was going to go horribly wrong at work and something did. You know just on a side note I've started to realize a trend in that sense. You know maybe I'm not the only one that's noticed this but why is it that when you go in to cover somebody's shift or you just go in just because you know you might need some extra hours you were asked to go in or some shit why is it that something bad always fucking happens when you go in something is just not right when you go into work on a day that you're not supposed to be there so anyways what happened was i get into work right for one the sauna is fucking broken apparently i don't know how the fuck it's broken but apparently over the past couple of days uh, some maintenance people were sanding the wood in there and then i don't know exactly what the thing is called that like uh polishes wood or some shit like that it's called uh varnish yeah varnish i think it's called or some shit like that I don't know. So anyways, once again, we had the wood in the sauna sanded, right? And I don't know what fucking genius thought of this that, yes, let's put wood varnish on the shit and then not let it dry and then let people go in there and sit on the shit. So guess what? Knowing my luck being just the great worker that I am, going in to take a part of somebody's shift, of course I'm the one that has to go and clean the shit. I just realized, oh fuck, please, can we please skip rundown? I don't want to play this map, please, please. Please. Fuck. So anyways, as I was saying, I was going to have to be the one to clean this shit up. And need I mind you, because people are sitting in this shit, I see literal ass and dick imprints in the fucking wood. And I'm just like, wow, this is such a great way to start my Friday morning. It's not like I wanted to be in bed right now, or at least waking up to be able to play video games right now. No, 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 no. You see, I would much rather wake up, go into work, and uh, spray the sauna down with the hose to get ass and dick imprints out of the fucking wood. Just like, yo, that is common fucking... Wow, okay. Well, at least I don't have to play run now but anyways yo that's like common fucking sense that's like painting a wall or some shit and not leaving a wet paint sign did i just connect into the same fucking lobby what the hell yeah i did i was just in here okay whatever You, sir, can go fuck yourself! The first person I shoot at, like, my first two out of three shots are painkiller hit markers. And then I proceeded to miss the rest because I'm fucking shit. But anyways. So anyways, yeah, getting back to what I was saying, yeah, that's how I spent my Friday morning. Uh, I spent my Friday morning hosing out the sauna. It was so fucking disgusting in there. Just, like, the even mix of, uh, I'm gonna make people cringe saying this, of the moisture, of the moisture of, like, the hot air in the sauna and then, like, the water that's evaporating up in it because it's hot as shit in there. You know, actually, go ahead and think of it this way. Think of, like, a really hot summer rainy fucking day and just as it's done raining you know like the sun starts to come back out and you can kind of see like the steam like rising off the cement and shit and it just feels fucking disgusting and all moist and just bleh. see that's exactly what the fuck it was like in there and then on top of the fact of people are like oh, why is the sauna closed what the fuck does it look like I'm doing? I am cleaning the bitch! Just the fucking logic of some people. I swear to fucking God. You know what, anyways, now that I'm thinking about it, now that I've said the word moist at least a good three, four times, how do the words moist and ointment make you feel? You see, personally, I know that a lot of people cringe at those words. <laughs> it's just so fucking funny to me. All right, well, it is a three on two, so I'm just going to go ahead and leave the shit. Okay, let's go free for all. Fuck it. So, uh, yeah, I mean, that's been my morning so far, and now it's uh, just about one o'clock in the afternoon it's a nice day got the window open and shit i'm still not going outside you know that's got to be some serious gamer logic right there you know it's a really nice day outside so you play video games but with the window open and uh just looking at this lobby i think i want to sweat till last i got them ears boy i don't got the accuracy though but fuck it Holy 
Fuck! He wasn't even aiming for me! I wasn't even in the kill cam! I was not even in his direct line of fire! What is this bullshit? You know, surprisingly enough, I got to last fairly easy. I mean, then again, I am tryharding an MW2, so that's also really easy. Now, if I can find a way to actually get up to the roof without getting killed, this will be magical. I won't kill you. I I'm right under you. Don't fucking hit the shot on me, though. You know, you're the real MVP for letting me get up here. <gasps> what? No! That should have fucking hit! <gasps> oh my god, no, he's gonna kill last. I fucking know it, dude. God. Ugh.